Hey guys, let us begin with our inside current affairs quiz. So we will we are doing the De December month MCQs. So the first fact is about FRBM Act. So these are the economy static quiz. So FRB Act has escape clause in it. So what are the grounds for this escape clause? Under which government they can have some leniency in the fiscal deficit, right? So what are the grounds for it? Collapse of agriculture and natural calamity, natural uh, national security, decrease in real output growth by uh, output growth of a quadrant by three percent below average of the previous four quadrants. So these are some of the grounds. And the next fact is about increase in bond yield. So interest rate in monetary system it will reduce like fallen return for investors in band government security will reduce and the next fact is about zombie firms what are they these are the firms not able, not able to cover their debt servicing cost with current earning and the next fact is about the evergreening of loan so lending a new loan to the borrower on verge of default near prepayment date of an existing loan to facilitate its repayment. Bank not required to disclose them. It is called evergreening of loans. And the next fact is about the P notes. In instruments issued by the registered FIIs to oversee the investors who want to invest in an Indian stock market without registering in SEBI. Offshore derivative instrument not enjoying voting rights. So they are also called software derivative instrument and they don't have voting rights, P notes, investor. And the next fact is about the UNG. So there is no such concept called veto power in UNG, United Nation in General Assembly. We have veto power only in UNSC. And the next fact is about the IRDA I Act. Uh, it came in 1999 and the headquarter is in Hyderabad. So it Initially, it was in New Delhi till 2001, after which it was shifted to Hyderabad. And the next fact is about MDR, multi drug resistance. So, it is a genetic predisposition of people, incorrect doses of antibiotics. So, predisposition in livestock farming, all these things, it will lead to multi drug resistance. And the next fact is about the Hornbill Festival, it is a festival celebrated in Nagaland. And also the last fact for today is about the Great Hanbil. So this is the state bar of Kerala and Arunachal Pradesh. So what is the IUCN of uh, Great Hanbil? It is vulnerable. So that's all for today. Thank you.